gypsies welcome back to my channel and happy Wednesday Wednesday okay so I went to the Dollar Tree this morning I got a haul here I'm just gonna show it all to you because it's a big Dollar Tree haul and instead of doing the little ones I kind of prefer doing big ones hold on let me see if I can get this fixed I don't know that might look a little better that's my widow's peak there and it just doesn't like I had this on the other way and I'm like that you can't really even see my face when I have like a hat on so or a cap anyway we're, we're sticking with this right here yeah happy day happy day okay so we're gonna dive in I got up or well not too early about 10 30 ish went to the Dollar Tree and found some stuff found some stuff guys Okay, so I'm just going to start here. This was probably the beginning of the store, actually. Um, I grabbed these right here. These smell really, really good, too. It's just the Citronella Incense Sticks. It's from Garden Collection. You get six of these, and when we sit out on the front porch sometimes, sometimes, you know, the, the if the bugs are out, you know, mosquitoes or whatever, they'll be trying to to pick you to death and it's just good to have something like this just to stick down in the flower beds in front of the front porch and just to keep those mosquitoes away so this is just for evenings on the front porch which usually I'm with Fifi whenever I'm sitting out on the front porch and then here's something I've been on the lookout for I did find the Spanish moss at some point but I had not seen this what are they calling it reindeer moss what a cute name I had not seen this and this was really what I was wanting to use whenever I do my wreath with the Easter eggs on it it's a week and a half from Easter and I still haven't done that what like why but anyway yeah this is what I was wanting to put on there like glue this all over the wreath and then glue the Easter eggs on top of these I just felt like they was gonna be so pretty I wonder if I'll even get to do that I don't even know like all of my stuff is down her house so I have no clue so anyway I did get three bags of that three of those okay and then I, I grabbed one of these they didn't have these the other day they just had the troll the troll ones and this is just Elsa and Anna just little hair clips for Jack they've been having a lot of new hair clips here lately especially well I was gonna say especially for kids but especially for everyone this is driving me insane okay so these are cute I hadn't seen I don't know I think I don't know if these are Greenbrier or not I don't think they are these are so cute so it's hashtag selfie lip pops so, you can see. And they could be Greenbrier because, you know, Greenbrier tricked me with the phone the other day. But you got the little snap, the pig snout, and the little cat nose, and the dog nose, and maybe two cats. Hashtag meow, hashtag oink, hashtag bunny, and hashtag puppy. So, this is a bunny. Okay. So, anyway, I thought those were cute super cute all right next next this is just a little bit of snacks um i got this for me because literally i had a bag of these last week like um i had a let's see i had breakfast and then i was starving at lunch and i'm like okay so i, mean, I was it was not my eat, fasting day of course it was my hashtag feasting day but i'm like i'm gonna go ahead and have me a few of these you know because pita chips are kind of better for you than regular chips anyway you know but anyway I love them they're so good and if I had a little bit of guacamole or salsa OMG like that would be so good so anyway I'm gonna save these probably tomorrow I'm gonna put them over there tomorrow's I'm fasting today so I can have them tomorrow but it's just the Stacy's pita thins five cheese and if you haven't tried them give them a whirl girl because they are so good so good maybe too good maybe too good and then I got these for my son um, these are the late July and I've bought these before I'm not sure if I've, I've actually seen the nacho chipotle ones but they have different little flavors out but I got the nacho chipotle and the jalapeno lime ones which I don't know like if you compare like this really really 
Well, I did have my glasses right here. I was just, I was just going to look at the like sodium content. Here they are. I was just going to compare the two as far as sodium content. Just out of curiosity. Okay, so this one has 520 milligrams per package. Jeez, Louise. And this one has 420. So as far as these go, 32 grams of carbs. 52. Oh my gosh. So this would absolutely be the best. Maybe I'll keep these. I'll keep these and give him these. <laughs> you got to read them labels, baby. That's still a lot of sodium, though, for someone trying to watch their sodium. It's still a lot of sodium, but these are absolutely the better of the two, So, which is not saying a whole lot. Okay, I grabbed these for my hubs. It's just his, his soft caramel, actually. I feel like his buff, his tan's already filled, but I don't want him to run out, so I've been getting some here and there. So I've got them stashed everywhere. So whenever he asks me if I had it, have any, I will absolutely have some. And then I just grabbed another pack of the triple A's. It seems like we are always using batteries for something. We actually the other day got a old time. Well, it's not old timey. It's new, but it's an Atari that you hook up, it's old school. Me and him both are just living in the 80s. Like, we just want to live in the 80s again, or even 70s with Atari. Like, so we got an old school with, you know, it has asteroids and stuff like that. So we needed four double triple A batteries for the joysticks, that, but they are wireless now. So anyway, it's, it's cute. It's just so, oh my gosh, it's so simple. We're like, how do we even love this at the time, you know, because now it's just look like, Jack Lee was looking at it like, what is that? And, and I'm like, this was our video games, you know, they were, they were horrible compared to what we have now. Now, you can be a video game and, and look just like a real person on there, but back then, it was Pong, you know, just the, and that was fun. That was the best years ever. Quit living in the 80s, girl. Okay, so I got my husband one of these the other day that was Bible Promises book for men, and he absolutely loves it. He's done read it one and a half times for sure. He takes it to his other job, and so I thought I'd get these. I'm sure they're, they're different on the inside. I was going to get one of the ones for women, but they were out of those. I figure a lot of people's getting them for maybe Mother's Day coming up to put in Mother's Day baskets and stuff. So this one just says, Bible Promise Book for Tough Times. He's going to be really glad to see that. We've been going through a lot of stressful things here lately. So this one is going to be a really good one. And then this one is just the regular Bible promise book. So I'm going to put these right here where he can see them when he gets home and he'll be glad to see those. Okay. Now, now let's see what we got. Uh, let me do the Voro really quick. I wish it's not Voro to me to me. Okay, I'm getting ready to show you something. See if you can guess what it is. <laughs> okay, so they still had it. They still had it, and I'm like, okay, I'm going to get four more. Just because if I go there and they have it, I'm always going to grab at least four, just because it's not too heavy, because I can't use my buggy. You know, I got to I gotta carry this stuff out to my car, and I don't like asking for help. I like to do it, you know? Even if I have to balance them on my head, I'm doing it. So I went ahead and got four more, and I just keep them behind my bed, drink them during the night, drink them in the evening, just drink them any, any time and all of the time. It's just, they're just wonderful. So anyway, okay. So I, I found, let me see, hold on. I'd like to show you all these, here they are. All of these together, because they are so cute, OMG. So I'm going to put these in Jack's room, and I just think that they are, okay, this is my least favorite. It's a, it's a tie-dye picture, and it's a unicorn, but the unicorn has issues. I mean, like, it's not even, I don't know, like, it's not even fancy, like, I don't know, like, it's my least favorite. Totally, totally. But all three in a row, they're going to look really cute, like, in her room. So, I really like 
you know, the, the, uh, you got the little jute twine, jute twine or whatever it is. Bur I don't want to say burlap, but it's not burlap. Anyway, they're cute. And the, you know, the sides look like tie-dye too. So they're really cute. I'm like, give me those. Give me those. I haven't seen them before. And then we have this little, what, a catacorn? Is that what it is? Like catacorn with shades, gold shades, gold horn. Come on, this cat's living its best life. I love it, and the tie-dye is not bad either on that one. I really like it, but look at that. The cat's saying, come at me, bro. Come at me, bro. And then, look at this. The tie-dye on this one's my fave. Like, that is gorgeous. I love blue and purple together. Like, it is the bomb.com. And then, the it's a chihuahua corn. I don't know. Is that, a, is that what you would call this? Chihuahua corn with glasses? Super cute. I know Jack's going to love that. So, that's cute. I cannot resist. I just cannot resist. Hold on. Let me get my bags up here, guys. Okay, I don't know what's in this, but let's do this next because it's super light. Oh, yeah. So, the other day, I got some. Uh-oh. Oh, oh, hold on. I got some. Hold on, I gotta stick this one back on before I show you guys because otherwise it's these are called butterfly bouquets, okay? The other day I got some flowers and they were sort of like an onion grass and what I thought were flowers initially in the middle. Somebody pointed out that they weren't actually flowers, they were butterflies. So I'm like, I, I went back and looked. I'm like, oh yeah, that's that's cool. They're they're butterflies. But they had these right here, and these are called butterfly bouquets. And you can actually see for yourself that these are big. I mean, the other ones had more of the onion grass stuff and just a few of the little smaller butterflies in the middle, which I might put all four of these together. No, not no. I'm gonna keep these all the, to themselves. I just think this, the, all of these together would make such a cute just like eastery looking bouquet i just love them i wish they had a little bit more of the onion grassy to them this you know this stuff here but i feel like they are just really pretty and i i don't know like i am not i, I like all different kinds of colors so i just think that all all of these colors together just look really pretty you know i just i just like them so i got one of each so, yeah, I may put them on my Easter shelf. I still haven't made my Easter shelf. Wow. Maybe I'll try to get to that today. Oh, my gosh. I'm bad. I'm so bad. And then I saw these. I grabbed these for Jack for Easter. Look how cute. Look. Do you remember? Just Do, do you remember being a little girl and wearing socks that look like this? so 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 cute oh my gosh so cute yeah so those are gonna be hers for Easter I still need to get her an Easter dress though and Easter is coming up really quick really quick I need to take a stand make a move do something girl okay so I grabbed two packs of this for my son he's addicted to fruit stripe gum so I got two packs give those to him. He's lo he loves it. And then I grabbed me a pack of these. It's just the um, electronics wipes. You get 25 in here. And between my computer and my phone and my hubby's phone and my daughter's phone, just, you know, just sometimes, especially like if she lets Jack play on her, I don't let Jack play on my phone, um, but Fifi does. And sometimes Jack will be snacking on cheese popcorn or stuff or something. And these come in really handy or just in general you know we need to wipe our phones down a lot I don't know if it's antibacterial or just to clean it probably just to clean it it just says um, safe on screens basically but you get 25 in here it's just good to have around 100% and then Jack's other markers that I got for our coloring were you know they're Dollar Tree they're not gonna last forever they were starting to run out so I just grabbed these. Look how beautiful. Don't that make you want to sit down and color? That's me. Totally. Still haven't found the coloring book bag. What's up with that? What is up with that? Like, if, if you guys know, let me know. I mean, like, is there coloring book fairies? I don't know. I'm just not sure. 
But anyway, I saw these. I had never, I'm not gonna say never, never say never, right? But these are Russell Stover caramels. Oh my gosh. I thought my hubby might like them since, he, since he's addicted to caramel anyway. Oh, they look so good. Look at them. Look at that. <gasps> yeah, so I'm going to give these to him, and I think I'll just stick them down there right now. That way. Yeah. Yeah. So I grabbed this, and the other day, if you remember, I got some spray-on hand moisturizer was it moisturizer or something like that and I was really kind of conflicted about that stuff because I'm like why would you even want to spray this on your hands but a couple of people had commented and said something like after using hand sanitizer it's just a way to maybe soften your hands or something like that so I'm like oh I guess that makes sense so anyway whenever I was smelling those two things I remember the orange one smelled fantabulous so these are the same line that they are Bolero but these are the alcohol free cleansing body wipes so this is in the sweet orange and I'm gonna smell them I'm gonna smell them I just want to cleansing body wipes so I bet they smell good yes they smell like a creamsicle oh yeah they smell so good they do oh my gosh so if you see these wait a minute I always have them upside down yeah yeah if you see these check these out because if you like the smell of creamsicles like orange cream it should say orange cream to tell you the truth it says sweet orange but to me they smell like cream sickles wow I like that I like it I like it okay so what's in here, what's in here? okay so I did okay let me show you this this is that high energy suet did I say it right uh, a lot of you guys was telling me how to pronounce it on there, and I'm like, okay, next time I get one, I'm going to try and pronounce it, but suet, suet, I don't know. Anyway, I bought one the other day, and I was super glad to get, get home and discover the little cage was still hanging on my fence, so I have a way to put them out there for the birds, so I grabbed another one because I want to see more cardinals around here. I absolutely love cardinals, and like, there's one right there. They're so pretty. So, yeah, I just grabbed another one of those. And then I got these for some crafting. I just think these would look really, really pretty on um, a wreath. And they, they only had four colors. I did get one of each color. This one, hold on. Yeah. So, they are just floral clips. Make a great accessory to wreaths, garlands, and floral arrangements. So, I got a white one and a blue one. Look how pretty they are together. Like, like not that I have my hair hanging down, but, I mean, I just love those together. Like, wouldn't that be pretty in your hair, even? I don't know. But I got those two colors, and then I got these two colors. Yes. So, I just thought that would be really, ooh, you know what would be really pretty? If you had, like, these in a garl, in a, um, on a wreath, like, if you get about 10 of these and just put them all the way around a wreath, I'm really digging that idea. I think that would be a really easy, awesome looking wreath. I mean, just imagine it. Just imagine, like, all the way around, you know, oh my gosh, I think that'd be so pretty. I might just do that because that just seems so easy. And to tell you the truth, I know, I know, I know, girl. Um, look at here. You could get one of the wreaths that are just the green, you know, just the green wire. And I bet you could even just clip these on all the way around. See the back? You could probably just clip these around one of them wreaths and have it done in like five minutes tops what a way to go like i'm just thinking that would be pretty pretty cool yeah and then i found some really really cute planners look at these look at these bad boys do you see what they show on the front so these are like one two they have six sides which is 
hexagon I believe somebody said last time <laughs> yeah so hexagon shaped I think they are really really pretty and I love what they have in them I just think they would you know they look really high end with just the way that the shape of them and the gold on the top they also had black ones with white on the top I didn't really care for those but these right here I think these are really gorgeous they do have the little holes in the bottom that you can poke out so so you don't get no root rot but these right here these are everything I'm digging these I really like these so yeah boom grabbed them steered clear from those black ones though I don't know if they would have wore black and gold I think that would have looked better but just black and white I don't know I just didn't really I just didn't really care too much for them. Okay, so I found one makeup bag that I thought was just adorbs. And I had not seen these net ones before. This was like in a weird spot. Like, where was this crazy thing? Like, somebody had walked around the store and gotten a few random items and just laid them down. Which I also found $2 bills. Not with this, but just laying on a shelf back in the food section two dollar bills laying there I'm like nobody around I'm like why wouldn't I get those two dollar bills like I would be stupid to walk past those two dollar bills I got them I mean I got them I just did I didn't turn them in I didn't I mean it was two dollars I, I just took them I just grabbed them anyway this says good vibes I love the green of it and the blue together it just looks summery to me like this would be a great little thing just to put a few little items in you know and you can see through it sort of yeah you can see through it but anyway i just love the net i have not seen any net ones had you guys is there more is like there a collection of these like greenbrier never comes out with one makeup bag like they always have to be three or four you know usually four involved so i just can you see the the net it's really pretty I liked it I grabbed it and then Fifi told me that if I saw any small envelopes grab them for her she also asked me to grab um, their dish sponges and they're round and that's the kind the only kind that I use and they didn't have any of those or I would have grabbed her some but they did have small envelopes I asked her if she wanted large or small and she said small so this is an 80 count. I'll throw those over there and she can get those when she comes for school today. And then they had a lot of these. They had a white one, a blue one, a pink one, and this green one. And they are BPA free. And they, on, on the front it says, cold drink. If you can, you can kind of see it. It says cold drink and they're really nice size so I'm like I'm addicted to water bottles anyway wait a minute Let's see if I can get the lid up oh there it goes yeah yeah so yeah I, I just love the way they made them look like sort of mason jars it looks like a glass mason jar type I really like it so I just got one I calmed myself down I'm like take a deep breath girl just get one pick your favorite color out and so, yeah, I feel like I don't have that many teal looking color things. So I just thought it was cute. And I grabbed it. I had to. And then, let's see. Apparently, I got two packs of AAA batteries. Do I? I don't even remember. Like, I thought I, well, maybe I grabbed two at the same time and they just ended up with different bags. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Just. I was losing my mind and then I found this gorgeous color scrunchie it's a velvet looking scrunchie and the color got me like that color like that'd be a great I mean I've been seeing Jeep colors there's a there's this color in a Jeep and I'm really digging it but if you if you have if you want a special color it costs more so like I probably won't end up with one that color but I'm really digging it but it's pretty for a hair bow too you know and I love the crushed velvet look of them Ooh, I have a, a purple one that's kind of crushed velvet you know you can wear them on your wrist if you want to just just go all out you know just go all out I finally got my Fitbit my new band and my charger so I've been I got my Fitbit on I've been doing good there's my new band I just wanted something different 
And then here's my new my new bracelet. Okay, one more bag, guys. One more bag, and we are at, okay. We're doing good. We are doing good. Good. Okay. So I'm gonna save the best for last, just because um, I grabbed these for my son. I don't know. I might save them for. Easter, should I? I don't know. These are Mike and Ike's. It says Mega Mix. Oh, I'm get, I'm kind of hungry now, now, so everything's looking good. Mega Mix. I like the way the rainbow and yeah, yeah. Does anybody? Let me just ask a question. I'm sorry, I keep tugging at that ponytail, but it just keeps going crazy. Uh, let me ask a question. This is probably a really weird question, but do you guys watch? Any of the ASMR eating videos, like there's Fru Fru, there's like Honey Bee, Mama Bee, like I don't know why, I, I'm, I've, I've mentioned this before, like I'm one person that I thought would never, ever, ever, ever watch anything like that, but here lately I'm like, maybe it's because I'm fasting, I, don't, I think it was before that, but I'm like loving to watch that at night time before I go to sleep. So, like, let, let me know. Like, let me know if you guys do that. Like, I just feel like, I, I remember when I first found out that people actually did that and made videos of that. I was appalled. Like, what? Are you kidding me? But now I'm like, I want to watch some. I don't know. It, does it take a weird soul to want to? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I'm weird. I am weird. Like, I, I just totally. Um, we needed some more of this Irish Spring original. There's nothing, nothing like that smell. I love it. My husband loves it. Okay, I got these since I still haven't given Miss Leslie her stuff yet. Yeah. Um, I'm working my way up to it, I'm telling you. These are cute. Look at these. So, they're paper shapes. You got 10 girls, you got 10 boys, and I just thought that would be such a cute project for, like, Mother's Day or Father's Day or, you know, just something like decorate this and make it you and you know to give to your mom or dad or mom and dad or whatevs but de make this you decorate this to be you you know what a cute idea that would be like i feel like the kids would would like to do that i just that's just me i just i just feel like the kids would like to do that and then wish list last two three items here wish list i've been seeing a lot of people haul them and like um, but I've seen like thumbnails, like pictures of them on people's thumbnails. So it's these, it's these. So I found, I mean, I don't know if there's any more items that go with these to tell you the truth, because I've only seen like a picture on somebody's thumbnail, Thrifty Tiffany for one, somebody else. I can't remember who it was for another, but there is this tray, which is so cute. Look at this. If you have a birthday, like, how cute would that be just to, to put stuff on? Like, I don't even know. I just think it's really, really cute. So, what are they called? They're just tumblers. You, you get six in here, and, like, here's what they look like. They are absolutely gorgeous. Look at them. So, like, for birthday, like, Jeremy's birthday is next month. I'm going to save these for that. Maybe Easter. Maybe Easter. Maybe Easter. I don't know. I don't know, like, I don't know what's going on, like, with, um, COVID right now, you know, so I don't know if we're going to be able to gather together or not, I'm just confused about it, like, I don't know what's going on, so, but anyway, they're gorgeous, I, I loved them, whenever I saw them on the, the thumbnail video, I'm like, oh, I gotta find those, so I really need to watch some more, um, Dollar Tree hauls. It's been a while since I've watched, like, anybody's Dollar Tree hauls, so I really need to get in there, watch them, see what's new. Like, some people have the best Dollar Trees. I mean, I'm thankful that I have what I have, because some people's Dollar Trees are horrendous. Mine's, I feel like, mediocre. Mediocre. Some are awesome, awesome, awesome. So, yeah. Anyway, that is my Dollar Tree haul for the day. Um, if you're not subscribed to my channel, guys, please hit that subscribe button. Leave me a comment down below. Thumbs up, like the video, give it a thumbs up, and yeah, I will see you guys on the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye!